I felt sad because I didn't know if I was going to be able to play in the games because I had no gear and I didn't have any cleats. Tonight, the Continental Little League said it wasn't their team, but the Crooks who struck out this time. Noah Fierro had his bag stolen, kept in the shed where he thought it was safe, and that's not all. Helmets, chest protectors, shin guards, and the league's PA system all stolen Thursday. It's just not fair. It's kind of emotional because Something like that doesn't care about the kids and just wants the stuff that we have. But after word got out to the community, there's now hope for the more than 200 little leaguers who were short equipment for the season. Everybody helped donate stuff to me and it was helping me because then I was able to play again. We're coming out on top. Nothing's going to bring us down. Nothing's going to put us down. League President Shannon Burkhart says other leagues, organizations and Little League alumni stepped up to help and already they received $1,000. In addition to a new security system, part of that money will be used to put these metal doors on all of their facilities. Now we're able to have all the little kids and the older kids play again so that we can all just have fun. Jacqueline Tawala in Salinas, your Central Coast News.